What's going on everybody, Mr. C here. The decision that I've made this week to open up about my sexuality has definitely been the most difficult thing that I've ever had to do in my life. But I felt like this was the time for me to do it personally and professionally. For me, I felt worried about how my family would be affected, how my coworkers and my friends and even my fans would be affected by this decision. Because in this hip hop community of ours, it's not cool to be gay. It's not cool to be bisexual. I felt that if I was to actually be honest about myself, that nobody would actually just want to deal with me anymore. But the more that I kept lying and the more I kept trying to deceive you and myself, the more that I was being more closed in and not really being who I really am. I also came to realize that the more that I kept this secret and kept lying and kept trying to be deceitful to the people that I love, I wasn't really helping myself or anybody else that probably couldn't need help out there. But with the grace of family and good friends around me, they made me feel comfortable to exercise my human right for sexual freedom. Instead of finding myself being self-detained by discrimination, judgment, criticism, and even violence from my own community. Thank God that I have friends and family that's gonna hold me down and make sure that I'm all right. I got tired of lying and hiding, but I'm here to tell you today, you don't have to lie or hide no more about your sexual freedom. This is why I have teamed up with the AIDS Healthcare Foundation. I am choosing to speak for myself and a new sexual revolution. Today, right now, it's about sexual freedom. You don't have to be afraid, but you do have to be careful and protect yourself. Did you know that each month, thousands of youths are infected with HIV and that one in three new infections are from young adults aged 13 to 24? Did you also know that young black and Latina women account for over 70% of HIV infections in their age group? Hey look, the stats are real. We know STDs will never disappear. On one of the times that I got arrested, I was forced to take a class about STDs. And even though I was forced to take this STD class, I learned so much about how you can contract STDs. You can be involved with somebody sexually and not even know that they have an STD. Please. Make sure you guys out there take care of yourself. Check out the AIDS Healthcare Foundation. At AHF, there's no judgment, no stigma, no shame whatsoever. You want to know why? Because AHF is revolutionary. Are you? The next sexual revolution is beginning right now. It is the battle for sexual health. We all have a right to a sexual life that is free from shame and disease. Listen, I opened up to y'all today. I gave you all of me. Now I want you to give all of yourself. Are you good? Are you healthy? Are you free? I can tell you today that today I'm free and I want you to be free. That's why I brought you here to freestdcheck.org. They are the largest provider for free HIV, AIDS, and STD services around the world. If you or a friend are ever in need, AHF have free and confidential STD testing and treatment locations all over. I'm talking Brooklyn, the West Coast, the South. They even have a location in Amsterdam. Find your location now at www.freestdcheck.org. It's free, it's private, and they're there for you when you need them. This has been a public service announcement brought to you by the AIDS Healthcare Foundation. Take a stand now. You can also log on to www.sexualrevolution2.org. Thank you for your time.